Betsy has a credit card with 17.99% APR and a $10,000 credit limit. The minimum monthly payment is 5.5% of the new balance. If Betsy went on a crazy shopping spree and purchased $6,430 on her card at the beginning of the month, what would her balance be at the end of the month? Now, I need to first say that it totally depends on your credit cards, right? A lot of credit cards, well, depending on when your um, cycle is, you, you usually have a chance to pay off your credit card before a finance charge is applied. Now, for this particular case, we are going to assume that she's going to have a finance charge from the very beginning. So, she now has a balance of $64.30, right? This is her new balance. And we're going to go ahead and say, by the end of the month, she's going to have her finance charge added to that. So, the real question is, how much more is she going to have to pay for her finance charge? So... If we take her balance and we multiply by the APR, now remember, APR stands for annual percentage rate. We're talking about one month. So we need to take that year and divide it by 12. Now when I divide it by 12, that makes it now a monthly percentage rate, which is exactly what we want. So when I take 64.30 times my uh, APR divided by 12, I end up to the nearest penny with a $96.40 finance charge. So to find out what Betsy's uh, balance is going to be at the end, I'm going to take my 64.30 and I'm going to add my finance charge of 96.40. So Betsy is going to owe 65.26.40 at the end of the month. And again, that's assuming that her credit card uh, has a finance charge before it gives her a chance to pay any of that off. So uh, there's your answer.